Shape merge. Shape merge is when we have a shape that is either embedded in a mesh object or it's subtracted from a mesh object. So we need two objects, a shape and some sort of mesh. And right now I have just a box here and I'm going to convert it to an editable mesh. And then, now I want to come back over here and I want to go and put some text on it. So I'm going to come here and put some text and I'm going to come in here and place a box in here and uh, I'm going to say it's KCC and I want to make it maybe a little smaller maybe here all right and move it on here and uh, hang on here I'm making too many of them uh, let's get rid of a couple of them over here and get rid of the other one here now I'm going to just take this and move it just so it's on the box here and now what I want to do is I want to do a select in place all right and I'm going to place that text Oop, let's do this let's just move this out of the way and I'm going to do a select sorry select in place I'm going to grab a hold of that text and place it right on there. Okay, so I need an editable mesh. <laughs> After all that, I need an editable mesh, and I need some text, and the text has to be positioned and placed on it. Now, once I have that, I can pick my editable mesh. I'm going to come over here to create geometry. I'm going to drop down menu to compound objects, and I'm going to go to shape merge. I want to verify that my first operant is a mesh. Here I got a mesh box. That's good. And now I want to select the move uh, operant and pick the shape. So I'll pick the shape. I'm going to come over here and pick the text. And now what's happened is it doesn't look like much has happened but that text in the mesh have been merged into one object. So what we need to do now is to right click and bail out of this uh, command. Now I want to view the shape merge object um, so I'm going to go and choose I'm going to pick on the object on the shape merge object I'm going to go up to the modify panel and in the modify panel what I'm going to do is I'm going to come down and pick the face extrude modifier. So I'm going to hit the modifier list. I'm going to come down and pick face extrude. In the amount here, I'm going to pick the amount. I'll say 10. And it's extruded 10. All right. And now what I'm just going to do is I'm going to toggle. You can see now my text has been extruded 10 units. The height of my box is 3, by the way. And so in this case, um, the shape was embedded with the mesh. I could have actually uh, subtracted the object by using the cookie cutter uh, option. Uh, so right now we chose merge and uh, that merged the two objects together. The shapes were merged together. I could use cookie cutter and it would have cut these text out of this shape if I would use the cookie cutter option. So this is the shape merge command and uh, it's used to uh, embed a shape into a mesh object.